Hi, I'm Steve Owens and this is Steve's Kitchen. Welcome back and a happy new year. Christmas is over, I've got some ham to use up, so I'm gonna make a classic split pea and ham soup. It's very simple to make. Come over here and let me show you how. So of course this is a split pea soup, so we've got our split peas, it's about 500 grams or a pound of split peas. Now I've got some ham off of my Christmas ham here, normally I would use ham on the bone, this one I've taken off, so I am going to use a couple of cups of stock as well, that can be chicken or vegetable, whichever you like. Now here's the flavour explosion, we've got a couple of sticks of celery, two carrots, I'm going to use a couple of cloves of garlic, I've got one brown onion and some bay leaves as well, let's get on and make this soup. So on a fairly large pan, on a medium heat, I've got a tablespoon of butter and I'm also going to add a slug of vegetable oil in there. That'll just stop the butter from burning. And we'll be using this to sweat down our onions, which I finely chopped. We'll just pop those in there now. And our celery also, which is just chopped into fine pieces. Now we don't want to really brown these, we're just letting them go for a couple of minutes, let them sweat down and become a little translucent. And I'm just going to add a twist of salt in there, not too much because we'll season this soup later. So they've been in there a couple of minutes now and they've just softened. I'm going to take my garlic, three cloves, which I've just sliced really, doesn't need to be crushed. Pop those in there. And then also the carrot, I've got two carrots there that I finely diced. Pop those in as well. So we just mix the carrots and the garlic in there. And now my ham. I've sliced the ham also into little cubes. I'm just going to pop that in with the vegetables. And I'll just stir that and cook that through for another couple of minutes. I mean, that looks delicious just as it is. <laughs> so now I'm just going to add into there one pint of stock. That's a vegetable stock I'm using. And a further two pints of water. And that's the beginning of our pea soup. Now we need to get those split peas in there. So I'm adding into my liquid a pound. That's about 500 grams of split peas. Now do check your split peas for stones and pebbles. This brand that I buy I know doesn't have any in. And I like to add a couple of bay leaves in there as well. So I'm just going to bring this up to the boil and then I'm going to put a lid on it and simmer it for an hour and a half or so, just keeping an eye on the split peas until they become lovely soft and succulent. So I'll just show you after an hour that's been simmering away and it's not quite ready. You can see the peas are starting to break down, but it does just need a little bit longer before it's a proper pea soup. Now my soup is ready there, it's beautiful and thick. You can taste it at this point and decide if you need any extra salt in there. I actually don't think it does, so let's get and serve this up. So there's my pea and ham soup, and I've just kept a little bit of ham to garnish on top. We're just gonna pop that in the center there. A little bit of toast, serve that up to your guests, or just have it on a lovely cold winter's evening. It really doesn't get any better than pea and ham soup. Warm yourself up on a winter's evening. We're actually going to be using this. We've got a series of Australiana cooking coming up, and this pea soup is going to be used in that. So share the love. Give this one the thumbs up. I'll see you next time. Let's give this a try. Take care. Mmm. Delicious. Now I know some of you will be trying to guess what am I going to be using the pea soup that's classic Australian. Comments down below, I'd love to hear what you have to say. I'll leave a couple of links to some other videos up there. Take care, see you next time.